What you see when you go through this house is what the house looked like when it was built originally in the early 1900s. Uh, a lot of the uh, moldings and baseboards needed to be replaced because somehow they mysteriously disappeared. Some of them just had so many layers of paint on them that uh, uh, you'd lose the intricacy of the moldings. The kitchen was remodeled probably in the 70s. It was in pretty bad shape and that's been completely redone. Cabinets are all brand new. Uh, within the last year and a half, countertops are all brand new. Uh, floors have all been redone throughout the house. to make this look like it did the day it was built, it would require uh, nothing more than some antique style wallpaper rather than uh, existing painted walls. Some areas I left untouched because I wanted to have that feel of uh, the way the place looked when it was originally built. Uh, you will notice as you look at some of the hand railings going to the second floor that there are some dents in it and uh, uh, I left those purposely just so you did have a, a feel of, you know, walking upstairs that have been there for a hundred years or more. So I took down the individual pieces of molding, marked them so I knew where they came from. I took them out to my garage, scraped all the paint off, sanded them each piece by hand, filled in holes and dings and dents, put a coat of primer on it, and then it made it easier to see the dings and dents that I'd missed, refilled those holes, sanded, uh, sanded them down again, and put a couple of coats of paint on them, reinstalled them in the location that they came off of, obviously filled the nail holes where we had to fix them to the, to the walls and uh, repainted all of that. The baseboards in many cases were just a total loss. So I had uh, copies of the original baseboards made by a uh, craftsman in Ferndale and uh, many of the baseboards have been replaced probably about 500, 500 or so square feet. As much as of the original hardware as possible uh, has been left in the house. Uh, in most cases it was painted over so I removed uh, each piece of hardware and uh, stripped the paint uh, off and refinished uh, all, the, all the plates and the doorknobs uh, trying to keep uh, the look of the way the house was originally. In many cases, uh, some of this stuff is missing, so I went out and replaced it with uh, pieces that I could find that were as close in appearance as the original, but probably 85% of the uh, hardware on all the doors uh, in the house is in fact original, 100 plus year old stuff.